What's going on guys? Welcome to another BeamNG video. We got another does it crash hard. We're gonna find out boys. Does this police interceptor package of the what is it? I think it's a Gavril what is it, moon or something? Let me see. It's the next one after the Gavril D, which is the last vehicle we finished on. So it is yeah, it was the Grand Marshal. I was gonna say it's a Gavril Grand Marshal. Hey, aka Crown Vic. Let's get it. All right, we're cruising. We're cruising. We are chilling. Handles nice, even at a good speed. Oh dear God! Oh shit! We good? That back door though, that's not closed anymore. There goes that seal. Yeah, we good though. That door is gonna bust open on one of these jumps, though. Ooh, that one was a close call. It was right on the way trying to pop out. Shit. It's definitely going pretty damn good for it. Ooh, hitting that fucking little hump before then fucked it a little bit. But it actually took it pretty good. The radiator's not leaking or anything. That's actually pretty mind blowing that it took that. Aggressive hit in the front end and no leakage on anything. One third completion, boys. Oh shit. Oh shit. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh shit. Uh oh. Oh, it's not gonna clear it. Get up there, go! Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, okay, let's assess. No way. Alright, hold on, hold on. We can, we can do it. We gotta just jam up. Come on. Ooh, wow, throwing the parking brake on there for a second. Let's stop. Come on. Yeah, I think it's it. There's no all wheel drive in this thing. It was a good run, Gavril. You made it a pretty fucking good distance. That's an unfortunate line, didn't it? We got a one-third completion with our police intercept. That's pretty damn good. Let's move on to our next vehicle here, boys. The van's a pretty good one, too. Definitely a favorite. Let's do this one. It's definitely got a good chance. I mean, I'm not going to go straight off-road because I've used this vehicle before. And it's... I mean, it would definitely probably tank for this. This is an off-road variation. It's not as... Uh, souped up. Damn, that was really smooth. Flip over. Good shit. We good. Try not to go too fast until it's just starved to boil. Let it get back to Oh, we have no control. I can't go left really. That's not gonna be good. Good thing oh shit, shit, reverse. Oh that tire is fucked up bad. I gotta like Oh, I think this might be it. Yeah, because I, that, that tire is going to be the end. That right tire. It, it's going to make driving almost damn near impossible. Yeah, like, look, I have to keep pulling up. Yeah. Yeah, that's a uh, jam the engine up. It was a good run. Well, it looks like, it, I mean, the suspension in the end is what kind of killed it. It's soaking in and taking all of that uh, force coming down and then 
you know, springing back up through those tires off the ground. And that proved to be the end of it. Now this one is going to be an interesting one. I'll do like, uh, I'll do this. Because this one is big as fuck, so I don't know that necessarily its engine getting flooded will be a concern. I think clearing some of those parts where you legitimately have to clear a little gap is going to be the end of it. How much, like, miles per gallon do you think this bitch gets? Fucking one? <laughs> We gotta keep it up speed. It's a big bitch. Uh oh. Ooh, that front tire's broke. Oh shit. Oh my god. The, t the weight snapped the fucking uh, suspension in the front. Is there, is the drive shaft snapped and it's just not showing? Or is this just all the force they can put down with only the back tires having drive? It's gonna get a one third. Holy fucking shit, a one-third. I don't think it's gonna make it two-thirds. It just does not possible. Like that one where the interceptor got jammed up? It's gonna happen here, Jay. What the fuck's going on? Oh, that tire is it's causing too much friction. Just jamming it up. Can't turn it all the way. Yeah, if we don't blow the engine out, we're gonna fail a jump. No way. I'm about to say, what's the driver part look like? Come on. Oof. Oof. That was a good effort, though. That one I did not expect a crazy amount of success from. But it got a one-third. Which, I don't know, I guess I expected it. Uh, this one I feel like it's glitch. We already tried that. We could try it again, though. Fuck it. But I think this one is a glitch. Yeah. Off-road pickup. Fuck it. Like, is, there, is the rest gonna load? Is everything loaded now? You all good? I feel pretty confident in this thing. This is the, this has literally got to be the best condition we've had a one third finish in. Just a hood popped and it looks like maybe spare fuel tanks.
Two thirds, and for sure the best condition at a two thirds finish. For sure. Turbocharger. Shit, it's blowing, boy. <laughs> oh! Hey, we close the hood. Like, holy fucking shit. The best condition we've had, man. I mean, sure, the fucking engine shit isn't mounted to anything, and it's just rattling the whole front end. Idling, but... It's rattling the whole frame, actually, but the front end is rattling like crazy. But dang. This is the best condition we've had a completion in. That's crazy. Full completion. Alright, let's move on to our next vehicle. Probably do... We'll do one more, and we'll call it. Depending on how quick it is, if this one like dies immediately after that first little hump, it will run out. Alright. Oh, this one I don't know how it's gonna do. Not very good. We'll do the fastest one we can get. 5.1. Uh oh. Oof. Oh, rear drive shaft broken. That's it then. It's unfortunate. Oh god, I just didn't have a... Yeah, I mean, I didn't expect much. We'll do one more from that thing. I thought it was going to wipe out harder, to be honest, and not just blow the drive shaft out on the drop. But that also is probably the... Uh, those two are probably the primary outcomes. Either blowing the drive shaft out on a landing, or losing control completely and wrecking out. We'll do the adventure one. Feeling pretty good. It's even got the fucking air intake. Put the uh, hood below the water line. Still getting air in there. Won't lock up your engine. I wonder if that actually is a functioning thing in the game now. Because it used to not really matter. It's just like an aesthetic thing to look good for the thing. But I wonder if they actually have that functioning for the air intake. Or a way to swap to that for the intake. Pretty damn good. God damn. 
Oh shit. Oof. Oh shit. Dude, this thing's uh, it's chilling. Two thirds completion. God damn. Think could do it. Oh fuck. Ooh. Uh oh. Damn, it's handling this like a champ. I mean, better, right? GG. Holy shit. What a fucking run. Completed the course. The final vehicle. Alright, boys. I hope you guys did enjoy. I hope you guys have a great day. Or a great night, depending on what time you're watching this. And I will see you in the next one.